In this video, we will solve a problem on geometric and harmonic mean. The question is the geometric mean and harmonic mean of two observations are respectively 18 and 10.8. The observations are 54 and 6, 81 and 4, 36 and 9 or 27 and 12. Okay, so we need to find out that two observations. Okay, so by geometric mean, what we mean? Let us write first geometric mean. Okay. Uh, let's give an example. Let us say we have observations x1, x2 up to xn. Okay, so let us say we have xn observations. Then its geometric mean is simply equal to geometric mean of xn observations is simply equal to the nth root of the product of the n observations. That means we multiply these n. Um, observation is with each other that's x1 into x2 up to xn we multiply them with each other and take their nth root that is 1 upon n okay and we are being told here uh, we have only two observations if we have only two observations x and y so it is geometric mean is simply so geometric mean of two observations will be equal to we multiply these two as i have told you if we have four observations we multiply them each other since we have two observations we multiply these two observations with each other and take their nth root since we have two so we take under root okay so one half this is our geometric mean and we are being told geometric mean is 18 so 18 is equal to x y raised power 1 upon 2 1 upon 2 so transposing it here it will become x y is equal to so it will become square here okay if i transpose 1 upon 2 it will become a uh, square here so 18 18 are it will come out to be 324 okay this is our one result also let's talk about the harmonic mean okay harmonic mean same example let us say we have x1 uh, x2 so on up to xn observations then their harmonic mean harmonic mean of n observations is equal to n number of observations divided by 1 upon x1 plus 1 upon x2 uh, plus so on up to 1 upon xn okay Again, since we have only two uh, observations x and y, their harmonic mean will be simply equal to harmonic mean will be equal to since we have two observations in place of n, we have two divided by one upon x plus one upon y. Okay, pretty simple. Harmonic mean is being given as 108, so I can write it as 108 upon 10 okay 10.8 is being given uh, converting it into the fraction okay let us uh, first uh, solve it here what it comes out to be 2 upon or let me write it here so we have 2 here uh, x plus y upon xy so this will become transposing it here twice xy upon x plus y okay when i solve this it will become twice xy upon x plus y okay i hope i am making myself clear we know x y is equal to 324 just plug this value here or let me write it here now to save space so in place of x y so we have two in place of x y i will write this 324 then we have x plus y is equal to 108 upon 10 multiplying this 2 4s are 8 2 2s are 4 2 3s are 6 o 8 divided by x plus y is equal to 108 upon 10 now going forward in this fashion we have now reciprocating both sides so we have x plus y upon 648 is equal to 108 upon 10 or x plus y 
is equal to 108 upon 10 transposing it will get multiplied 6 so I have to reciprocate on RHS here also since I have reciprocated on LHS so we have 108 here so 108 into 648 okay so 108 when we solve this 108 10 10 60 so we will get x plus y is equal to 60 x plus y is equal to 60 okay so we have x plus y is equal to 60 and another result that is x y is equal to 324 we have these two observation uh, results here okay so sum of the two numbers is 60 and product of the two numbers is 324 okay can we solve it straightforward i guess not then we need a you know formula which obviously i know you people know it very well from algebra that is uh, a minus b whole square is equal to a plus b whole square minus 4ab this is the formula so in place of a and b we have x and y so writing this formula that is x minus y whole square comes out to be x plus y whole square minus 4 xy so x minus y whole square as it is x plus y whole square we know it is 60 60 square minus 4 into xy is 324 324 so 60 square comes out to be let me write it here 3600 minus 4 4 are 16 4 2 are earth again now 4 3 are 12 1 2 9 6 subtracting this so dhana is shat the four now and now the zero pantana is the three two three zero four okay so x minus y square came out to be this thing okay if i transpose this square here it will become under root okay so let us save this stuff here so this becomes uh, this 2 3 now what is 2 3 0 oh, 4 it is square root let's take the square root uh, we have uh, 4 4 are 16 so shara sada through so we have 7 here we have 0 oh, 4 here 4 to 4 8 now 80 88 into 8 so 8 8s are 64 8 8s are 64 and 6 is 70 that means square root of 2 3 0 oh, 4 comes out to be 48 okay that gives us x minus y is equal to 48 let me rub this out again so x minus y is equal to 48 which gives us x is equal to 48 plus y okay and we also know that x plus y is equal to 60 x minus y is equal to 48 so solving this x is equal to 48 plus y just plug this value in this x plus y formula so in place of x we have 48 plus y uh, plus we have this y is equal to 60 so we have uh, y, y, y to y gets y transposing this 48 it will get subtracted with this 60 so 60 minus 48 comes out to be 12 which gives us y is equal to 12 upon 2 which is y is equal to 6 so the value of y is 6 now what will be x simply put this y is equal to 6 either in this equation or this equation let's put it here okay so our x will be equal to 48 the value of y is 6 which is uh so the, this is 54 that means the two observations will be x is equal to 54 or and y is equal to 6 so this option will be correct okay i hope i make myself clear thank you